Hello YouTube, Deep Sketch here with another tutorial. Uh, I would like to do a tutorial on this style. So not this tower exact, just this style. Well, I am going to be doing this tower, but it's, it's really a tutorial on, on that style because um, I've uh, just just randomly sort of on other projects that really been using this, um, this style a lot. And uh, I thought, why not share it with you guys? So uh, that's what I'm going to do. So first off, let's say, you know what, let's make a wider version of this. So this is, I think it's seven wide, so let's make it nine wide. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And um, I'll just be creating the one side. Let's just do that. Uh, I'll just be creating the one side and then just use a uh, weld edit to... Um, to uh, um, to copy paste the other sides, so let's just make two layers of brick, stone brick, and then I put a layer of regular brick on top of that, and then a layer of sandstone. style is not that difficult, but still. Oh, that was wrong. Yeah. Put a brick on top there. And let's just give it one more sandstone layer on top. Yep. Cool. And let's see, we want windows there and there so a layer of that there that's this and this is that one two one two and one two so these we're going to fill out with stone bricks and uh, we got this And uh, that outer bit is also pretty easy, so just all the way up there. And I think the height is, I guess, up to you. I recommend there. So I, I think that makes some arches. And because we've got a wider gap in between um, these uh, outer pillars or thingies, um, what you can do there is just take a slab slab, stone brick slab, and place it there. That works. I think that works very nice. And uh, upside down stairs, and normal, normal stairs. And then just fill this up with stairs. And we got that. And uh, it's actually the top bit that really makes it for me, at least. And uh, I'll show you so let's put one more layer of stone and just say one stone there and one stone there. Give it that and give it these upside down there all the way over there. And a layer of sandstone on top. And you know what? We're going to make it like this this time. So three sandstones on top and stairs in between. Slabs on top and slab, slab, slab on top, slab on top. Boom, bada boom, boom. Great, I did something wrong. Yep, I did something wrong. You actually need to put a slab there, and this needs to go one more out. So there and there. Well, this is not going to match up. I was just going so well. <laughs> okay, so a slap there and a stair and slap there. 
that is actually just the only side you need and then you I'm just gonna oh apparently well that it doesn't work I must have messed it up somehow pose one and set oh pose two and let's just copy it from yeah Copy. And let's see, one, two, three, four, five. So that would actually be there. And then that there. And let's say paste minus A, so we don't have to paste the air. Oh, and I forgot to rotate it. Rotate 90, and then do the same paste minus A. There we go. I th No, that's wrong. I remember now. Yep. It needs to be over there. Let's try that once more. Uh, let's see what. Yep, that looks perfect. And let's just rotate it one more time. There. Let's see, one, two, and paste minus A. Yep. And rotate one more time. I think this is right. Yep. And we got. Oh, of course. Okay, um, and for the floor, uh, the, the top thing, I, I just used uh, my version of uh, jungle wood. But what I would actually recommend is doing something rather different than what I've done over there. Because I have an idea I want to show you in one second. So I would just align, align this top this level with, um, with some kind of wood, any kind of wood really, or stone if, if you want, of course, and then just take slabs, oops, I didn't put that in, slap, there. and um, do that, so when you really need to look over the edge, you just step up to this, step on this, and still walk on this so um, that is really neat actually and what I also tried to do was um, was uh, combine some of these towers so I'm gonna I'm just gonna try to do that now by let's see if I just say pose one and pose two say copy somewhere I want those to be the entrances so I'm gonna say copy there copy oh I copied a lot actually I only wanted that oh I think I got that no what did I get oh I'm, I'm just gonna try so that would be okay I need to think now I think it would be there. I hope so. Paste minus A. Yeah, it worked. And I'm stuck. Why am I stuck? There. Uh, whoa. What did I do? What did I do? I did something. Yeah, just remove those. No need for those anymore. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. You know what? Actually, undo. And that's right, just raise it by one more level. I'm just going to do the time set, 08, there. Yeah, that's much better. Now we got these, but you wouldn't be able to go back inside. Um, actually, I think these need to be, need to be sandstone. So just, all these need to be sandstone. Um, and what you actually could do is now we can leave those. I'm just gonna clean those and fill them up with sandstone. And now we have something like this. Oh, we need something like that. Why is it not? Nope. And 
that to me is just look how much smaller that that it's the exact same tower that one and that one and looks so much smaller up there so weird isn't it but then it's you could actually make that tower uh taller as well i think it actually it is shorter oh it is why is it short oh because those are three levels i messed up you know what it doesn't matter you get the idea um you know what for fun let's just try to make one more level um so i'll just delete this oh look at this oh look at this come on come on come on come on there and then stamps that all the way And what do you like? Stone? Uh <laughs> wood, jungle wood. And there we go. And just slams all the way around. Oops. My game is sort of lagging a bit. I'm getting some strange Ah oh, it's just so annoying. The frame rate is not really Okay, um, and let's create an even smaller tower. So I am, we could do the same thing. So I would do something like this. Something like that. And then something like this. Whoops. And on the other side, sandstone. Again, I'm using sandstone, but you could use any material you'd like. I think it will work. Probably not with pink wool, but we could try. We could try. Ooh. And there. Come on, one more layer actually. If you're really, really spun. <laughs> If you're really spontaneous, you could actually make an even smaller tower to go on top of this, but uh, who has the time? I do, apparently. Or you could just make an even bigger tower underneath that tower, and then we just pile on and pile on. You could also, so to keep the theme, because you know, when I do this, you know that, this tower, um, it only has one window, and uh, the one below has two windows, and the third one also has two windows, but it has a gap in between. You could do something like that. Um, that might work better for you. I don't know. Um, but it's just I've been avoiding doing that because because of that. Um, but yeah, totally up to you. I just really, really love this style. I think it's so good and it goes with so many things. Not Nordic, but certainly Imperial or uh, Eastern, maybe. Or Romanian. I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm just saying it's, it's very, it's just so nice and it's very easy to remember because there's a very clear pattern to it. Oh, that's not right. Apparently, I can't remember it. <laughs> uh, it's just... I just have fun every time I build one. Because it's just so... Ah. <laughs> that That's really the best way I can explain it. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> same pattern all the way. So this is a quite extensive tower. And um, I don't know if I'm gonna stop here because I just really want to keep building on this tower. Maybe try them, try the tower in some different colors. Oh, 
Oh, that looks great. That's just lovely. Except that that is too short. It could just be used for so much. So um, I'm just oh, that's bad. I'm just gonna stop here and um, thank you so much for watching and uh, see you next time. Bye.